Hey y'all, Heidi here, BananaBuzzBomb.com. This is actually a Saturday evening video. I'm recording my Monday buzz on Saturday. I know it sounds crazy, but there's a method to my madness, I promise. Um, wanted to share a few things with you in regards to what I've been going through the past few weeks in regards to my Half Rev 3 training. Um, for those that don't know, I am currently training for a Half Revolution 3 triathlon. And basically what that means is I'm training for a Half Ironman distance triathlon. For those that don't know what that means I'm training a lot of hours I'm going to be training even more hours in the coming weeks and it's not gonna be a lot as long as the full obviously but it's still gonna be a lot for me and it's been a huge undertaking for me and I've been going through some intimidating situations for myself and I'm overcoming those situations so I wanted to share some things with you Every few weeks, or every week, depending on the schedule, I have my training schedule come down or drop, as I like to say, into trainingpeaks.com. The Rev3 coaching will drop it into my, my account, and I sign in, and I see what I'm going to be training um, for that week or whatever. And every time it happens, I have freak out moments. I'm like, oh my gosh, how am I going to be able to do this? Like this week I'm scheduled for 8 hours and 45 minutes of training over the entire course of the week. Next week it's like 11 hours and 10 minutes and I'm thinking, how am I going to do this? But you know what? Every week I make it work. So I don't know why I freak out. Why am I freaking out? I have no reason why. And also tomorrow, you know, I'm supposed to be scheduled for a like 2 hour and 20 minute bike ride, which will be a personal longest distance for me. I've never ridden that long on the bike. Last week I did 2 hours, but I'm also hoping to train, uh, train outside tomorrow. As you know, I've trained outside on my, my tri bike before and I have fallen. I recorded my, um, post ride talk to you. I didn't actually record me falling. Sorry guys. I'm sure you would have probably liked to see that, but, um, it's very important that I get outside because I need to get outside on my new bike. You know, it's a new bike this year, so it's very important that I do that. And I need to start scheduling actual races into my, my schedule and, get into that racing mode or at least the atmosphere of it so it's very important that I get out so hopefully fingers crossed I'll get out tomorrow and also fingers crossed that um, I will actually be able to fulfill the two hours and 20 minutes or whatever it is I can't remember it I have to look it up before I go out um, but I wanted to share this with you guys because I'm hoping that someday I'll be able to look back on this and be like, Heidi, you're freaking out for no reason. Or maybe some people that, you know, in the future, they're going to be doing the same thing and know that somebody else went this through this too. It's not, you're not crazy. And lastly, maybe somebody or someone somewhere might be able to give me some insight, inspiration into things, you know, and just say, hey, relax, you're going to be okay. You know, I don't know. But hopefully tomorrow I will be able to do another video for you guys. And I'm actually going to put these two together so it will be all in one video. But after my bike ride tomorrow, and I hope that it all goes well and I'll give you an update then. But that's what I'm buzzing about this week. I'm kind of freaking out. And I know I can do this. I got this. I've got this. Just keep repeating that to myself. Keep smiling and be grateful. Talk to you later. Hey y'all, it is Sunday morning, actually almost afternoon. I've been busy doing stuff around the house and now it is finally time to get out and ride my bike. Um, like I said, two hours, 20 minutes plus a uh, like 10 minute run afterwards. I'm freaking out. I can't put into words basically what's going through my head right now. Um, I wanna vomit. I'm just, I'm so nervous. And something that I'm kind of compromising on uh, is instead of riding my bike from my house out to like the countryside where I'm going to be riding, I'm actually driving somewhere, gonna park somewhere and then go from there instead of fighting off the traffic. I live in a touristy area, so I just did not want to deal with the tourist traffic trying to weave in and out with my tri bike. And so like I said, it's a compromise. I feel a lot better doing this, so that's what I'm doing right now. But um, I know, once again, I really don't know why I'm documenting this other than I think I just need to because I want to show you guys that this is serious for me, you know. It's it's something that I'm really undertaking and that I'm really nervous about. Um, but I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it. So I'm driving to where I'm going to park and then we're going to go for a bike ride. So wish me luck and I will talk to you guys later. Keep smiling and be grateful. Hey y'all, I did it! Woo! Believe in yourself, that's all it takes. Um, I'm super happy. 
I just got done. Here's my proof. I don't know if you can see that. I have a huge amount of improvement to do, but that wasn't what this was about today. It was about getting out, hitting the road. I'm stoked about it. I couldn't have been happier with my situation. Um, I stink really, really bad. I think I stink worse than some of the roadkill I passed out there today, and I passed a lot of roadkill, but um, I need to pee too. I need to pee really bad. I need to learn how to pee on my bike. Uh, that's in the future. Anyway, I need to head home. I need to find a bathroom. I need to get a shower, but I did it. Believe in yourself. Whoo! Go to my blog. I have a couple pictures of things I saw on my, my ride today. Um, I just gotta get going because I gotta pee. Keep smiling, be grateful. Talk to you guys later. Bye.